Yeah, the full moon hangs out there like a great big fat slob, sending out its psychic vibrations, making man's brain real with the possibilities of Friday night <laughs> in the 20th century. By George, it is a trail that knows no ending. The possibilities are rife. One, two, three. All together, gang. It's Friday, my God. He always sings. Raggedy music through the cattle as he swings. Back and forward in the saddle of a horse. Pretty good horse. The syncopated gators and the such a booty meter to the road of his repeater. How they run when they hear this fellow's gun because the western folks all know he's a high fellow from rootin' tootin' tootin' son of a gun. Oh, I did it again. Stop it, stop it, Eddie. Did it again. Oh, one, two, three. Try it all over again. No, just go into the second course. Come on. Just let her go. Second course. Oh, let's try it again. He always sings. Now, oh, come on. Oh, we're going to get Nola next. Come on, you're ad living ad. Cut it out. Kill it. Stop. <laughs> Raggedy music to his cattle as he swings Back and forward in the saddle of a horse Pretty good horse that is sink to pay the gators And there's such a funny meter to the roar of his repeat How they run when they hear the smell of gun Because the western folks all know He's a highfalutin' rootin' tootin' Son of a gun from Arizona Ragtime cowboy, talk about your cowboys Ragtime cowboy, Joe All together, gang Oh, how magnificent I'm telling you, quality shows in the end always. It may take two or three choruses to come through, but you just can't push it around. I mean, talent is a rare thing. It grows like a radish in a field of carrots. I mean, you can fool the people for a long time and make them think that they're getting getting radishes, but by George, the carrots will... All right, let's try another one, Eddie. Blow it, man. Margie, I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the world I love you. Don't forget your promise to me. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. Days are never blue. Oh, after all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, it's you. Oh, that was great. Ah, we're trying out new things here tonight. It's Friday night. And uh, Friday night is a night for rebirth. It's a night for renewed hope. It's a night for, once again, falling into that same old trap that you always fall into, that it's going to happen this weekend. <laughs> right? Well, at least we can always approach the Emerald City with a certain degree of objectivity, knowing that we've been on that way before. Now, would you like to hear the... Eddie, let's go. Would you like to hear the second chorus of Margie? Which is really just the first chorus repeated all over again. One, two... <laughs> Everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. Days are never blue. Well, after all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, it's you, 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 Margie. I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the world I love you. Don't forget your promise to me. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. They are never blue. After all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie. Oh, Margie, Margie. Oh, Margie, 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 it's you. That a boy. Ricky Tick. Magnificent. 
Ah, uh, George, anyone like to hear that again? Even one small little guy wants to hear it again, I would be willing to sing it to 12 midnight tonight. Let Long John take over the profundities. He's got a lot of profound people there. Well, uh, one guy wears a little hat with a propeller on the top, and he's very profound. He gets these emanations. Now, if there's any of you out there would, <laughs> would like just one, I just want to hear one person who would like to hear Margie again, because Margie could very well become our song. You like to hear it again? Anybody out there? Oh, I need a little. You know, all you guys are always talking about how how talent has to be has to be encouraged. Well, I mean, put up or shut up. Put it right where your mouth is. You know, if you're going to encourage talent. Uh, oh, 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 Eddie, look, we've got another request for Margie. By an odd coincidence, another. Oh, yeah. Uh, think, 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 think. Oh, oh, Margie, Margie. I'm always thinking of you, Margie. Oh, I'll tell the world I love you. Don't forget your promise to me. Rick a think a think a think. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. Days are never blue. After all it's said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, it's you. All together, gang. Margie, I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the world I love you. Don't forget your promise to me. I have bought a home, a ring, and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. Days are never blue. After all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, it's you. Speaking of clinkers, this is W O R A M and uh, F M New Yorky. <laughs> oh yeah, let's go, gang. When you're shopping around in your neighborhood for Italian flavor, that's extra good. You should choose Kelowna, that's what you should. For Italian flavor, that's extra good. Yes, friends, Kelowna grated Parmesan cheese is extra good because it's aged for over 60 days. And then it's vacuum-packed to seal in the freshness the same day it's grated. Always snowy white, fluffy light, and sensitive. That's Kelowna grated Parmesan cheese. <laughs> when you're shopping around in your neighborhood for Italian flavor, that's extra good. You should choose Kelowna. That's what you should for Italian flavor. That's extra good. <laughs> Hey, these guys, that's a tough agency. Guy I got a note from, I'm... I'm... This black face with the big shoes. Oh, crying out loud. You got to go to great lengths, you know, to get that Parmesan cheese moving. We got uh, another thing here. Let's see. Uh, show magazine. And uh, pick up a copy on your newsstand. It's a big, heavy magazine. Proof cover. So you can hold it in your sweaty hands and it won't run. And, uh, you know, it's very good. It's very good that way. They have very expensive materials in it. And they have an excellent novel in it running currently, which I would recommend. The Tin Drum by Gunther Glaus. Very good. Yes, it is good. I mean, I'm being facetious here, but after all, you can't get mad at a guy's nationality. We have here, uh, don't you? Let's say I missed the formal codification 
of uh, nitwitism. Speaking of nitwitism, this is WOR, AM and FM, New York, has systematically skipped all Andante passages in everything he's ever had, and so he thinks all music is loud. It's very interesting because that's a record problem. And if you have problems like this of, let us say, electronic selection, or if your woofer makes its own editorial statement, I would suggest you consult the Electronic Workshop, 26 West A Street. It's the only electronic workshop that I know that understands. Uh, 26 West A Street in the village, it's the electronic workshop, and they sell hi-fi equipment and nothing else. No wearing blenders. Uh, let's see, speaking of wearing blenders, we've got, oh yeah, speaking of wearing blenders, that reminds me, Verdi's three-act opera, Un Bala Un Mascara, will be presented as the season's seventh live metropolitan opera presentation on WR Radio. The secret is out. You know why they moved me from Saturday? Because I came on before the opera. That's the truth. And all the opera fans were really getting thrown into a, into a thing, boy. Every, every afternoon they'd tune in five minutes early and get me. And uh, this, I'm telling you the truth. <laughs> Somehow Martin Block is more profound. And now let's see. We have uh, with us Mandarin House. Speaking of profundities, and if you've never tried uh, Mandarin food, I would suggest you give this a whirl. It, uh, I, I will give you one word of warning, though, and I mean this very, very much. If you are hung on uh, the egg roll, chop suey, egg foo young type of oriental food, you are going to get very mad at Mandarin House. No, this is true. Uh, many people I know who have gone down there who are the egg roll types really get teed off. This is Mandarin food, oriental food. It's exceedingly good. I, I, in fact, to connoisseurs, fine Mandarin food is comparable, if not superior, to some of the finest cuisines of France. Uh, it's very different, very subtle, and highly complex. And the Mandarin house is one on 13th Street between 6th and 7th in the village. It really is a good restaurant. They have a bar. And the other Mandarin house, which is also Mandarin food, but slightly different. It's more Sichuan. In its, yes, this is a different province. It's on uh, 2nd Avenue, just off of 57th. Both of them are open on the weekends, and they're great for Sunday dinner. They have a bar. What is this, more Margie fans? I'm not going to do Margie again. I'm getting also fantastic complaints. The, the, the uh, composer of Margie called in. He said he's going to threaten a lawsuit. I have had David Merrick called in. He says if this happens once again, he's closing down Oliver. We've had all kinds of angry things, and I do not wish to... In fact, we've had 27 requests for me to sing the Cologne of Parmesan Cheese song again. If it's Italian flavor that you really want. Well, I've been wanting to do that. Of course, you understand that I'm using my Jersey City delivery on this type of singing, which I think, under the consideration that it is... Mon After all, let's, 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 let's look, look at it honestly. Friday night is a Jersey City night. Uh, uh, really, it's the truth. I mean, in Jersey, I can just see it. they're festering in the drive-ins and the diners. From here all the way to Morristown, all the way down to Camden. All the guys in their 47 Mercs are pulled in there, you know, with their jackets. And all the guys with their pick them off the gas pipe rack sport coats are having their high night. And it's Jersey. I mean, let's face it, this is Jersey's night. So it is. It's the truth. I mean, I, I suspect that Jersey, eventually, they're going to take that Garden State Jazz off of their license plates. It's going to be the, the state for 30-second seat covers. And, uh, you know, either that is going to be the state of the pizza and drive -in, the drive-in pizza joint. I I'd love to see states really come out with truth on their license plates. <laughs> Look, wouldn't it be great? Uh, wouldn't it be great? Uh, can you imagine Alabama's slogan or Mississippi's slogan on its license plate? <laughs> I mean, if the, if the states really come out with their real feelings about things, you know. I can just see uh, New Yorker has a state. Uh, well, as a matter of fact, uh, the the, the <laughs> can't you just see the New York state says, "Get all you can, state." Uh, either that, or it says, "Make it big, state." New York. All right, I'll, uh, uh, do you want to hear Margie again? You know, speaking of uh, speaking of Margie, as long as we're on the subject, uh, I was very early influenced. As a singer, by by uh, Stan, 
Vaistani, you've got to admit that if I don't have anything else, I have vitality in my singing. You've got to admit, vitality is another name for brass. Now, uh, most singers who sing in musicals have no talent whatsoever, cannot sing a note, but they got plenty of just what I said, brass. Now, uh, brass often passes for talent in our world. It does. So does aggressiveness. And in fact, I'm thinking of opening a, a school of aggressiveness here in New York. It just teaches nothing but various types, the more subtle types of aggressiveness, which, uh, you know, you can be aggressively peaceful, which is, of course, what most peace demonstrators are showing. I mean, in fact, there was one peace demonstrator who wrote a letter to the Village Voice this week and says, all of us peace people should get together in a militant organization. <laughs> Signed, a peaceful little peace-loving girl. Oh, yeah, yeah, one of the scariest letters I've read in years. And it comes so close to the truth that, it, you know, it makes the things curl on the end of your feet. Uh, you know, wowie. Uh, so, so uh, you mean there are more people want to hear Margie? Or do they want to hear, ah, uh, he always sings? Or they want to hear the Sheik of Araby? Yeah. Ten people want to hear Margie again? Oh, for crying out loud. I mean, you know, I mean, I'm, I'm used to these wild encores. I'm used to this tremendous applause that roars up there out of the Bronx and out of Queens. But this is overwhelming. Now there are three people who have called in and want to hear. Three people are applauding wildly now in Babylon. And if, if, it, if it finally results in seven people applauding wildly, I might go back out on the stage again to belt out another unforgettable, another unforgettable, beautifully delineated course of Margie. I'm always thinking of you, Margie. <laughs> See, singing is, largely, singing is largely putting the pauses in the right place. I'll show you. Now watch. Margie, I'm always thinking of you, Margie. Now, that's the way people would ordinarily sing. Now, here's the way you really sing it. Margie, I'm always thinking of you, Margie. You see the difference there? Oh, my technique all over the place is just crawling. Oh, there's another one, huh? Ragtime. All right, Eddie. Once again, we bow to the great will of the public, WOR realizing its enormous responsibility in the realm of public service, sends you once again, due to overwhelming response, Oh, as well, hold it, hold it, Eddie. Wait a minute. No, no, no. Hold it, hold it, Eddie. We're going to have to make this a public service. This is going to go on the log. Tell Jack it's going on the log. The following rendition of Margie is being sent to you by the U.S. Marine Corps. Yes, friends. Yes, young men. If you are looking for a career, if you are looking for a career with a great future to it, with a uniform, a career that could give you all kinds of kicks, we suggest you consult with your local Marine recruiter. And I'll send to you as a public service by the Marine Corps of the United States... We bring you another great public service. All together. All together now. Ho, 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 ho. Margie. Oh, Margie. I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the truth. I love you. Don't forget your promise to me. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration. Days are never blue, blue, blue. After all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, oh, it's you. Oh, Margie, I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the world I love you more. Oh, forget your promise to me. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You've been my inspiration, days are never blue. After all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, Margie, it's you. All together, gang, now. I'm always thinking of you, Margie. I'll tell the world I love you. Get, get your promise to me. I have bought a home and ring and everything for Margie. You're playing it at 150. The restoration days are never blue. Oh, after all is said and done, there is really only one. Oh, Margie, 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 Margie. Margie. It's you. Oh. It's you. <laughs> All right, none of that jazz in there, Ed. The next thing I know, he's going to have a special record player. You know, I have, I have a sneaking suspicion that tonight what I ought to do is just do nothing but belt out songs. I mean, it's Friday night. I mean, if Ethel Merman can get away with it, let me tell you, she's all brass at a yard wide. I mean... <laughs> oh, yeah, for crying out loud. 
What is this? All right, do you want to try it? You want to try Ragtime Cowboy again? You know, it took me all of 1962 to lick it, and I'm working on the Sheik of Araby for this year. This is my thesis this year. And uh, as a matter of fact, uh, actually, the, the, the one that... Uh, did I leave my Sheik of Araby words? Yeah. No, oh, I've got my Sheik of Araby here. I've got all my material here, and I'm certainly very glad. Oh, that was sent to you courtesy of the Marine Corps. Hey, Jack, that goes as his public service, you know. It sure does. Boy, I probably put 14 guys in the Marines there in the last five minutes. <laughs> I could see some clown winding up at Paris Island, you know, <laughs> euchred by Margie. He'd be down on chicks the rest of his life, if not singing. Uh, and more angry calls there? They're really getting mad now, aren't they? That's right. Four angry calls. All right. Well, I mean, let, let me tell you, I mean, anger is really the, the, the yeast upon which the fruitcake of the soul feeds. And I'm giving you even a more, a greater public service than ever. Every time I tee you off, Dad, I'm getting some of your glands going. Only some of them. The rest are up to you and your chick. Well, all right. Well, that may be an impossibility. I know. You're full of excuses tonight. All kinds of bumbling excuses. By the way, did we get an angry call from, 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 the, uh, the, from the head of the Diners Association <laughs> and the drive-in motel organization in Jersey? No. Jersey, the drive-in pizza state. <laughs> oh, George. All right, you want to do Ragtime Cowboy Joe now? All right, you see, I'll tell you what's, what's rapidly happening here. I, I, I'm going to have to give you a play-by-play -play description of what's happening. The audience is dividing up now into two distinct classes, as it always does. There's the slobs. And there's the good guys. Now, uh, one group is calling in for me to, to sing Ragtime Cowboy Joe and Margie again. The other group is saying, knock it off, will you? Yes, it's dividing into two groups, slobs and good guys, the way the world always divides. All right. I will have to bow to the will of one side right now by singing another great chorus of Ragtime. Yes, Oh, what a cowboy. Ragtime. Talk about your cowboys. Ragtime. Cowboy Joe. He always sings raggedy music to his cattle as he swings. Back and forward in the saddle on a horse. Pretty good horse that is syncopated, gated. And there's such a funny meter to the roar of his repeater. How they run when the hill is full of gun. Because the western folks all know he's a highfalutin, rootin', tootin', son of a gun from Arizona. Ragtime cowboy. Talk about your cowboys. Ragtime cowboy, Joe. Okay. I killed that one. You notice how good I do that one now? I don't even make mistakes anymore. Do you want to try Sheik of Araby, Ed? Please play Sheik of Araby there on the table. And uh, we're bowing now. Uh, boy, that one's really sore. See, as I said, the good guys and bad guys are out there in two different classes. And uh, slobs and the anti-slobs. <laughs> slobs and the anti-slobs are out there. So, uh... By George, I can hear the flames crackling already up around my feet. I can feel the rope tightening around my neck. <laughs> I'll stand here and look you right in the eye, and you can blindfold me, and I'll refuse my last cigarette just to show you that I'm big and brave and uh, have plenty of brass. Plenty of brass. Oh, this is magnificent. The sheep of Araby. Oh, your love belongs to me. At night, when you're asleep, into your tent I'll creep, creep, creep. The stars that shine above will light our way to love. You'll rule this land with me. I'm the sheep of Araby. I'm the sheep of Araby. Your love belongs to me. At night when you're asleep, well, bow, wow, wow, into your tent. I'll creep, 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 creep. The stars that shine above. 
night Our way to love, love, love You'll rule this land with me, me, me I'm the sheik, the sheiky, sheiky, sheik, sheik, sheik Barrel of me, all together is wah, 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 wah Very good. Very good. I think I'll cut... I think I'll cut a, an LP called Shepherd Sings Rotten Songs. Rottenly. <laughs> I, I mean, really, I'd love to do that. Shepherd Sings Rotten Songs. Rottenly. Now, there. We have done, we have done our, little, our little thing for tonight. And, yeah. um... Uh, and uh, I feel better. I feel somehow... Don't you feel a little... Really, now, I, I just want you to look inside yourself. Just for one brief moment. Seriously, friends. As Bert Parks would say so aptly. Seriously, friends, I want you to consult and look carefully and very, very objectively at your neighbor for a moment. Now, you may be in a difficult position to do that at this time, but I would like you to go with it mentally. You see it there? <laughs> yes. You see it there now? Okay. Now, I want you to honestly tell me if you don't feel cleansed after tonight. After the past 40 minutes. Don't you feel somehow that a statement has been made by all of us? Don't you feel that somehow barnacles of inhibition have fallen by the wayside? You feel lither, trimmer? Jaw squarer, stomach flatter, fuse more steely, eye cooler, don't you? Now, anger does it. Anger did it. Did it for you. For, for once in my life, I've done something for you. I've angered all of you for the last 40 minutes and thereby making you feel younger, harder, more able to cope with the world, ready to belt. I mean, really teed off. I mean, you can't really get mad at Goldwater. Now, if you started a tap dance and throw rubber footballs to the crowd, you maybe could. You can't really get mad, but you can get mad at me. I'm here for that purpose. What else is there in life but to help your fellow man? My George. And I'm going to help you once again by singing another chorus on that unforgettable tune. That tune that all of you have been waiting for. A tune of all of you have been writing in and asking for. A tune that many of you find unforgettable. That tune that is the one that Eddie has on the turn pay. Well, there it is. Oh, all together. All together now. I'm the sheik. I'm the sheik. I'm the sheik. Oh, your love belongs to me, baby. At night when you're asleep. To your tent, I'll oh, creep, 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 baby. Now oh, the stars that shine above will light your way to love. Is everybody happy? You'll rule this land with me, baby. Oh, I'm the sheik. I'm the sheik of Araby. Oh, Siri, my shadow and me, just we three, wandering along for the old streets of memory. Yes, we're all alone, just me and you, baby. At night when you're asleep, in your tent all creep. Oh, the stars that shine above. Yes, sir, we'll light our way to love forever. You'll rule this land with me, baby. Oh, is everybody happy? I'm the sheik, the sheik of Araby. Together now, let's all sing this grand old tune on the Sheik of Arabies. Oh, ho, your love belongs to me, baby. At night when you're asleep, when you're asleep, baby. Yes, sir. Enter your tent. I'll creep. Oh, the stars that 
shine above. Oh, those old stars will light our way to love. Yes, you'll rule this land with me forever. Oh, baby, I'm the sheik, I'm the sheik. Yes, me and my shadow, and me, I'm the sheik of Araby. Is everybody happy? I thought you'd be pleased the way it turned out. Just thought you'd be pleased with the way it turned out. Just thought you'd be pleased with the way it turned out. Oh, it's warming up. Well, by George, we'll be warmed up by the time those sports news comes out. <laughs> okay, I'll just sit and wait. And while I'm sitting and waiting... Are you kidding? Is it warming up? What's warming up? Antifreeze in the Ampex? For crying out loud. <laughs> he was you learned. Oh, there it comes. Is everybody happy sneaking in there behind us all? Keep your knees loose, Dad. And good luck to all you Jersey cats out there. I charge that old diner never looked better. SRA Jersey, the 42nd, 42nd seat cover seat. Jersey, the 1963 pizza drive-in state. Ah, uh, waiting out there, American culture marches on. All right, George, pass the pickle lily. It'll be all right. 